The year is 2220. The place is the asteroid 253 Matilda, now on the cusp of the Tau Ceti system, after 114 years in interstellar space. <laughs> if they could see us, it'd look like we're walking around in slow motion now. Time is passing at different rates, here versus there. Relativity gives me a headache. You're 82 years old! How the hell do you expect to take 8G's acceleration and then fend for yourself on an alien planet with who knows what dangers? Face it, this is a one-way mission. A suicide mission even if everything goes to plan. Did you bring up the mission with your daughter like you planned? She blew up at me! Treated me like I was being ridiculous! Wouldn't even consider letting me go! Made me feel like a child. You know, you're as crazy as Salish. He had no business flying that ship at his age, and look at where it's got him. I envy him. You're jealous that my husband is dying out there all alone? Not of the dying part, but of getting to take those risks. He still matters. He still gets to work on things critical to our mission. What's the first thing that's going to kill him? Air, food, water? His air should last a couple weeks. But he won't last more than three days without water. Do we have our first crime of the year? No, but we've got our first mystery. Damn right we do. Don't touch anything. We'll be right there to check it out. Sure, I wouldn't dream of messing anything up before you smart people take over. Why are we going into the mines? I know very little about mining technology. Ambassador, we've just discovered what appears to be non-human technology. Naturally, we wonder if it could be placed by your people. In a mine shaft. That's correct. About nine kilometers down. We have never done any mining on this asteroid. But could one of your people have placed a burrowing device meant to go deep into Matilda for some scientific purpose? I have heard of no such thing. Okay, atmosphere outside registers good and the heat will last us a while too, so no need to suit up. Stand back while I open it up. There's an emergency. I've got to take this. This mission is a way I can make a difference again and spend the rest of my life doing something momentous. God knows we need every idea we can get to have any chance of saving Peters. Join the mission now by clicking the crowdfunding link at quietpleaseorg 253. For just one dollar, you can get digital downloads, early access, and special thanks by name and credits.